<laughs> okay, hey, what's up everyone and welcome to another Gore's trailer reaction. About 15 trailers came out today, so I'm just running through, watching each one of them. This one is a huge one because it is a launch trailer for a game I cannot wait to play, and I'm sure you can't either. Fallout 4. This Tuesday, baby. Woo! I can't wait. And uh, I'm getting the Pip Boy edition. And I am going to be playing the entire day. I might even stream it. I'm not sure. We'll see how I feel. But uh, that might be a game I want to like play and like uh, just like freaking invest myself by myself. So uh, let's let's watch this trailer. So if you want to watch it, go look up Fallout 4 launch trailer. And then uh, I'll count it down. We can watch it together. Uh, soon I will be putting the trailers in the actual video. So, uh, yeah. Anyway, there you go. Thank you. Let's watch. I don't know why I said thank you. Three, two, one, and then play. There you go. So if you want to watch it with me, sync it up there. Ooh. Nuclear. Everything can change in an instant. War can't. This wasn't the world I wanted, but it was the one I found myself in. Okay. I thought that was a voice actor. I'm ready. ready. Because I know war. War never changes. No, you get Ron Perlman and say that. I don't want to hear from you. I have a question. The only question that matters. It's a lot of scenery Would shots. You risk your life for your fellow man. Nah, Even fuck that. If that man is a simp. I don't know about the faces there. Beneath the Commonwealth, there is a cancer. Known as the Institute. Nah, a malignant growth that needs to be cut before it infects the surface. They're the real enemy. A lot of scenery not shots. Raiders, not the super mutants. Not even those tools over in Diamond City. Diamond City. Don't shoot! I swear I'm not a sin. For God's sake, we're family. This is ridiculous. Yo, we're family. All right, that face looks better. Oh, fuck you. Oh, oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Raider scum. Build our hideout. On a minute's notice. Decide our own future. Oh shit! Time, the the Raider, 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 Raider will be costly, but in the end, we will be saving Super Mutants from its worst enemy itself. So hey! Jeeves, or whatever his name was, Jarvis. How do I get there? Death Claw, guys. Now that you've been paying attention, you don't find the Institute. The Institute finds you. Oh, Robo Man. Celebrate history. Oh, dog meat. Yeah. Let's bond. What? Okay. Let's go, boy. I switched it up for the. For this trailer, now it's a girl at the end. I got confused because it, it, her hair looked like a big, massive texture, so I thought it was someone with a big ass helmet on. <laughs> they had a regular vault suit on and then a big ass helmet. I was like, wait, what? Well, no, it was just her hair. Alright, and the next video is about to play. No, 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 not the Star Wars trailer. <laughs> they had suggested uh, videos there, I clicked the Star Wars trailer on mistake. Alright, so there you go. That, oh no, it's playing. Stop. All right, so that was the Fallout 4 launch trailer. That was really good. It did a good job of just setting up the scenery, kind of like what the first trailer did at, uh, well, before E3. And then, of course, E3, they showed off more of the game. Um, but, yeah, they did what the first trailer did, where it was just like, just like scenery shots and then maybe some gameplay here and there. But it gave me a little bit more sense of what the story is actually going to be about. Not really, but uh, kind of, a little bit. But um, that was really good. It was really, really, uh, it's really nice to see all the different enemies and stuff. A lot of them are the same from Fallout 3 and uh, New Vegas, but that's fine. Uh, some new, I noticed. Uh, I like, I like uh, that it's going to be more story and maybe dialogue focused. I mean, don't get me wrong, Fallout 3 had tons of dialogue, but this one seems like it's going to be more focused on characters and actually 
starting to like these characters or whatever, uh, which uh, I don't think Fallout 3 I ever really gave a shit about any character in that game. I just, I usually murdered most of them. Um, but, you know, that's just me. But that trailer did a great job of just showing what I uh, can't wait to do. <laughs> and that is walk around a wasteland, shooting things, it's discovering things, looting corpses, doing missions, just having a good old time. Just having a gay old time. So, there you go. That is, uh, that's it. That's it. That, that's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. I'm gonna give the trailer an. Uh, I'm gonna give it a nine out of ten. It was great. Not perfect. Uh, a, a little bit too many scenery shots. Maybe a little bit more should have been focused on other things besides that. Maybe uh, they showed a little bit of the customization of the house. I would like that they showed a little bit more customization of the weapons. Maybe just like show a cool ass weapon being built and then used or something. But whatever. It's uh, three or four days. Well, five days until it comes out. So. Like, who cares? Like, I'll be able to check that out soon. So 9 out of 10, it's a great trailer. I hope you enjoyed my Gorse trailer reaction. Thank you, and until next time, goodbye.